I can't wait to get back to performing again. We missed all of last season because of COVID and then this spring as well. So this is really my first time back on this stage in about 18 months. But I'm very excited about it, a little nervous because, you know, I've been trying to play and sing at home and stuff, but that's not the same as having a big audience. Charles Fraser, the man who built and developed all this, who is uh, buried under the Liberty Oak tree here, he had a real sense that he wanted Harbortown to be a gathering place for families from three-year-olds up to grandparents. And you can walk around the harbor and see multi-million dollar yachts uh, or sit down and have an ice cream or lunch or whatever. And I think everybody feels comfortable here. The scale is, is designed on purpose. If you look, there's nothing more than four or five stories high. So you don't feel dwarfed by buildings or uh, any of that. And he really wanted nighttime to be a family gathering place, almost like going to camp and having a around the campfire kind of situation. So uh, they found me at Disney World and I came here and, and I was here for a two week job and two weeks became two more and two more and here we are starting our 44th season. I think what people really enjoy is watching a four year old come up and do their thing. Uh, it's it, it makes for uh, just great fun. Spencer is your born, you're never gonna see my unicorn. One more big hand for Courtney. Way to go, Courtney! Sea Pines people tell me some three million people have sat here. It's hard to imagine. You know, I thought one of two things was gonna happen for me because I've never ever been out of work since I started doing this. Uh, all through college, from the day I graduated un until recently, I had always had a very busy calendar, up to 300 nights a year, uh, traveling all over the world on cruise ships to the ski resorts in Colorado, college campuses, festivals, all that sort of thing. But I always look forward to coming home to Harbortown. And so having not performed for 18 months, you know, it's, it's a little, little scary. Uh, but hopefully it'll be like riding a bike and it'll all come back to me. I, I have been working diligently to play and rehearse and, and do all of that. But uh, I'm excited about reconnecting because we've literally established relationships with generations of families. Grandparents brought parents who brought kids who are now bringing grandchildren. So it's, it's a real special connection. And, and that's a great sign for the economy here, for all the workers who, uh, you know, have, have struggled in this resort environment over the last uh, year and a half or so. So we are thrilled that people are back and having a good time and riding bikes and going to the beach and going on dolphin cruises and hopefully coming out for some nightly entertainment.